When we think of the Italian Mafia, the images that come to mind are usually from a Hollywood movie or a TV series. The notorious organized crime syndicate has been portrayed as a brutal, merciless, and ruthless group that operates in secrecy and controls every aspect of society. Although the depiction may not be entirely inaccurate, there's more to the Italian Mafia than meets the eye. In this video, we're going to delve into the top 10 facts about the US Mafia that are both intriguing and informative. Before we get started, be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to be notified when we post more amazing videos like this in the future. And here we go. Number 10. The Sicilian Mafia is the mother of all mafia. The original Italian Mafia, known as Cosa Nostra, originated in Sicily during the 19th century. This infamous crime syndicate continues to exert influence and carry out illicit activities to this day. With an estimated membership of up to 5,000 individuals, the Italian Mafia maintains a strong presence across Europe and North America, operating as a formidable force within the world of organized crime. Despite geographical boundaries, the US Mafia maintains deep connections with its Sicilian counterparts, as well as other prominent crime syndicates in Europe and South America, forging alliances that expand their reach and influence. Number 9. The U.S. Mafia has different branches. Within the U.S. alone, the U.S. Mafia has a vast network of crime families making it exceptionally difficult for law enforcement agencies to trace the activities of individual Mafia members. These branches are distributed across the U.S. Some of the largest are located in New York, Chicago, and Los Angeles. This nationwide structure has enabled the U.S. Mafia to remain a powerful force in organized crime for decades. Additionally, they are able to expand their operations into other countries with relative ease. Not only do foreign branches of the Mafia benefit from the wealth and resources of their American counterparts, but they also provide a safe haven where criminal activities can be sheltered from law enforcement. Number 8. The U.S. Mafia has a numbered organization system. The Mafia follows a strict hierarchical structure that is based on numbers. Each family is headed by a capo di tutti capi, or a boss of all bosses. And then are the lieutenants, or sotto capi, who carry out the orders from their superiors. This system makes it difficult for law enforcement agencies to trace the activities of individual Mafia members. The organizational structure of the U.S. Mafia is designed to ensure that those at the top remain sheltered from law enforcement. Furthermore, each family has its own unique code of conduct and internal laws which must be strictly adhered to by all members. The consequence for breaking these rules can range from a formal reprimand to expulsion or even execution, depending on the severity of the effects. Number 7 the family code of silence. Although every family has its own unique set of rules, as we just mentioned, there's one thing that is universally understood, the code of silence. Silence is a key to the US Mafia's success. The family code of silence, also known as Omerta, is an unwritten code followed by members of the Italian Mafia. It requires all members to remain silent and not divulge any information that could incriminate another member or jeopardize an operation. This code is strictly enforced and has enabled the organization to survive despite numerous attempts by law enforcement agencies to bring them down. Omerta is often cited as a key factor to the success of the US Mafia and its ability to remain undetected for so long. Number 6. The Mafia uses pop culture references as codes. The Mafia has been known to use pop culture references as codes when communicating with each other. For example, the phrase Godfather is used to refer to the head of the family, and the term Don refers to a ranking member. The Mafia also uses symbols such as the Sicilian flag and number 5, which can all have different meanings depending on the context. This is one way for members of different families to communicate without outsiders understanding what they're saying. While the use of such codes and symbols may be difficult to decipher, it is important to remember that the U.S. Mafia remains a powerful and influential force in organized crime, and this is just another one of the many reasons for that. Number 5. Al Capone U.S. mafioso Al Capone was one of the most notorious and powerful figures in the U.S. Mafia. 
he rose to power as a major bootlegger during the Prohibition era and eventually became head of Chicago's organized crime scene. Capone is responsible for numerous illegal activities including racketeering, gambling, extortion, and murder. His reign of terror came to an end when he was finally convicted and sentenced to 11 years in prison for tax evasion, of all things. Today, his legacy remains as a reminder of just how powerful the U.S. Mafia can be. Number four, the Mafia controls many illegal activities. The Italian Mafia, known for its notorious reputation, is deeply entrenched in a wide array of illicit activities. From drug trafficking, to prostitution rings and extortion, to racketeering and money laundering, their criminal operations knows no bounds. Furthermore, they cunningly exert their influence to manipulate illegal enterprises, including construction and garbage collection. Despite facing some setbacks in recent times, the U.S. Mafia continues to wield significant power within the realm of organized crime. The criminal masterminds have managed to establish a complex network that spans across various sectors, posing a constant challenge to law enforcement agencies worldwide. Number three, the Mafia has its own language. Within the U.S. Mafia, many members employ Italian dialects such as Calabrian and Sicilian to communicate covertly. These intricate languages not only pose a challenge for outsiders to comprehend, but also provide a means for members to exchange information discreetly. Moreover, apart from utilizing regional dialects, the Mafia has developed its own clandestine jargon known as Mafia Lingo. Yes, that's the scientific name. This secretive linguistics network adds another layer of complexity to the intricate world of organized crime. Number two, the Mafia operates in secret. Similar to the Illuminati or the Freemasons, the U.S. Mafia is a clandestine secret society that thrives in the shadows of society. Operating with the utmost secrecy, they employ cryptic language and intricate symbols to communicate covertly amongst themselves, effectively evading the watchful eyes of law enforcement agencies. This veil of secrecy has been instrumental in preserving their formidable power and influence for several decades, making them an enduring enigma in the world of organized crime. Number one, the Mafia is still an active force. The Mafia may have lost some of its influence in recent years, but it is still a major force in organized crime. They continue to operate in the shadows, engaging in drug trafficking, extortion, and other illegal activities. The Mafia's active operations often go undetected due to the secrecy that surrounds them. Despite their reputation, the U.S. Mafia is still a very powerful organization with far-reaching influence. Although they are not as prominent as they once were, their operations span across the country, are shrouded in secrecy, and are vastly underestimated. And that's all we have for today. We hope you enjoyed this video. If so, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and drop us a comment down below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.